See, I turn back up again and the trains arrive. That's exactly what we've come to expect. Uh, right, okay, now then. Um, uh, I love the taste of fairy liquid in the morning, as well you know. Uh, right then. Uh, hello again. Uh, right, now then. Uh, so that's that's come on quite nicely. Let's have a quick look at the uh, the profitometer here. Uh, now we haven't uh, we haven't pork barrelled this year. We have spent heavily though. So we got thirteen point four in, and just shy of ten out. So nine point five out. Uh, that's quite promising. So that means we're we're kind of like three million in the in the uh, in the positive in November. Uh, that's that's a good sign. Um, yeah. Okay. Right. You shouldn't be sharing a platform. You're not sharing a platform. That's good. Uh, what's the good situation look like here? It looks like it's empty. You've got stuff waiting. That's good. That's that's all jolly good. There's an, an Utini. Uh, more trains for the Red Star, says Mr. Zorn. Thank you very much, Mr. Zorn. Uh, very nice of you. Um, uh, right. Let's... Uh, uh, Let's let it know. I'm going to take a quick look at the food. Oh, look, there's food waiting. Uh, it's always nice when uh, when stuff works out. Right now, we're going to build a viaduct next. We'll get that. Uh, we'll get that done. Uh, it's high time I put this viaduct mod to uh, to, to good use. I think. Um, um, and uh, and after that, I think we'll probably connect up another city. I've got the money for it. Uh, one thing I do want to check is what the turnaround time is on the food train here. Uh, what did I call it? Mine's gone blank, but it's going to have a, it's going to have quite a lengthy turnaround. I would have thought. Here we go. Hubs food twelve minutes. It's not super quick. Uh, again, that's another candidate for the um, uh, for the, the the what's it called the, uh, the, the the Atlantic as soon as that's available. Uh, that'll that'll help out significantly. Uh, what are we what are we carrying food wise at the moment? Let's have a quick look at the. Uh, uh, the line list. Now then, where are we? Food trucks. Trucks that carry food. We are currently carrying 12 of 60. Well, it's actually 12 of 72, uh, which isn't brilliant. Um, but that, that line needs to bed in a little. Uh, meanwhile, how's our, uh, our worst performing train is 300 grand in the red. That's okay. That's That's not too bad at all. Uh, hubs food is obviously costing us a bit at the moment that that number will go up uh, but there we go there's another one just popped green so if I can I mean, we're, we're easily offsetting the, uh, the the loss trains at the moment and some of those will will turn green uh, with with just a little bit more patience uh, but when you've got stuff like this turning up on a regular basis that's a good sign um, you know what, I think it might be worth a second train to go down and process that fuel. Uh, but we do still have some waiting anyway. So I'll, I'll leave that just a little bit longer and see where we get on. Right, now then. Uh, now is about as good a time as we're going to get for this, uh, this bit of rearrangement. So let's pause it there. Okay, now then. We'll go from... Uh, I don't want to delete the bridge. So don't delete the bridge. No one's forcing you to. You don't have to. This is this should be quite easy because it's just a straight line. Right. Are we still going uphill at that point? We are. Right. We'll go as far as there. Uh, and then we'll get that round the corner, and then we'll see uh, we'll see where we get to. Uh, the reason I deleted that last section back is because I, I want to keep this on the flat rather than going down. So that will that will do the smallest of raisings there. Now then, let's have a look and see what uh, what we end up with as a result of this. Okay, so there's the embankment being built. It still goes down a little and then heads back up again. Uh, so let's, uh, let's not build that. Let's, uh, let's continue deleting back just a bit. Mm, no. If I do that, then this is going to end up being exactly the same design as the bridge, which is not what I want. I want to, I want to play with this, um, uh, 
I, I want to play with the bio notes uh, and make that exciting. Delete again. Well, I delete because that's how we how we live. Um, but let's take the track back a little further. So if we kill off these signals, uh, and then we stick a, a very, very tight uh, junction in there, we should be able to just get rid of these two bits, like that. Which will leave us a little runway there, and then we can, uh, then we can bulk this back out again. Uh, Right now, the other—I mean, the other way we could do this, of course, is we do a little bit at the front to keep it up high. That's the smart thing to do. Let's see what this looks like first. Do we still have a a, a bow going on? Yeah, we most definitely do. Okay, right. So we'll uh, we'll build a uh, we'll build a bit here that stays on the flat instead of going down. On the flat, please. Okay, good. All right, pull you up alongside. There we go. So that's basically just leveled that off there. Now, the question is, is it going to allow me to uh, to select something other than a standard embankment? The answer is no. Okay, right. Now then, I saw the... Mm, yes... Uh, right, how am I going to... Interesting. Uh... Any ideas? Press M. Yeah. Press M. Nope. Press M again. Now, you see, now we've got that, but it's too high. Uh, and, uh, and, you know... We, we could go with this. Now, ignore the fact that it's going underground there. Uh, it is too high, because now it's going uphill further than it needs to, but not by a lot. And let's have a look at it down this way. Unfortunately, those, those speed markers are, uh, are, are kind of are betraying the uh, the line here. I don't want to delete the bridge. I mean, you can see why I don't want to delete the bridge. The bridge is flipping brilliant. Um, no, I really, really, really do not want to delete the bridge. And also, I don't want to continue the bridge's design uh, further down this way. What I want is just a very simple... Well, what if I decrease... Now, you see, that turns into groundwork again. Um, I mean, that looks quite... Not, that's quite... Oh, yeah, that's quite eerie. Um, but though that's not what I want either. And don't uh, I don't approve of any of this, you know? No, I, I just I just don't. Um, any suggestions? Should be able to create a set of points on the bridge so you can delete back and only a small part of it. The the, the only problem with that is uh, uh, is that the bridge will continue the same design. Continue the bridge, but selecting the viaduct thing with the same design. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's gonna, it's gonna do the the same thing. But you know what? Uh, it's it. We can give it an experiment and see what happens. I don't want to delete the bridge. Um, so let's uh, let's do the same. Let's do the junction trick again on here. Uh, that's had a slightly unexpected. Uh, Unexpected manoeuvre there. Uh, let's... Yeah, why is it doing that, I wonder? Yeah, no, that's... That's, that's not what we're looking for, is it? Um, okay, odd. Weird. Uh, let's hit bulldoze. Apparently I can just bulldoze that bit. Okay. Right, well, that, that, uh, that's the thing that happened. Um, right, that, good. Now then, if we flatten this bit out... Like that. And then, uh, and then we'll go from there and we'll see what happens this time. I think it's going to do the same, the same, style, of, uh, the same style of action, though, you know. 
and it still wants to keep going downhill. So uh, we want to... I mean, I don't mind a little bit of groundwork in between just to uh, just to break up the the style, which is what it's done here. Uh, except it looks like it's going up there. Does that look like it's going up? Well, no, no, it's not. It's it, it does look like it's finishing on the flat. Uh, so that's okay. But you know, let's let's make this straight, shall we? Uh, and like that. Okay, right. Now then. Mm. Now, feed the bridge towards the hub. If you hold shift, you can delete smaller parts. Yes. This much is true. Uh, okay, right. Well, look, we've made, we've made it this far. Let's see what happens this time. It's an enormous amount of groundwork again. All right, that's, that's one, one dose of M on there. Now, this bridge is long enough. That, uh, that that will be a very smooth amount. Now, look at it, though. It's just, it's just not, it's not great. But it's going to be, it's going to be worth it. It's, uh, it's totally worth it if we, uh, if we do some kind of, you know, we're here to viaduct people, so let's viaduct. Uh, now, we want something that is of the era. That's, that pattern is a bit too dense uh, for my taste. As is that one. There was quite a nice, a nice, quite a nice brick pattern here. That one's all right, but again, you see, I mean, as soon as you back up, it's very, very repetitive. Uh, you can ignore the underground stuff; that'll obviously disappear as soon as this is placed. Um, I think this is the. I think this is my favourite. But my goodness me, that's a that's a tiny bit of texturing going on on there. Uh, what do we think? Uh, do we want option two or three as nice brick? Okay, let's have a look. Option two or three, two. No, oh, you're you're not wrong. Actually, that's quite ple that's that's quite pleasant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. good, 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 good. Uh, or three. You again. You have you have chosen well. We're going to go with. Uh, I think we'll go with the desert brick approach here, since it fits the surround. Now, do we want to bridge it like this, which it, which is quite imposing. Uh, I mean, that's a, that's a nice look. Or do we want the solid underground there? Uh, what do you think? Mr. Hipbone says, uh, says th you want three. Okay. Uh, you want three. We can go with three. It does look better. You're not wrong. If I hit N, now it disappears. Um, so that's, it's still not sitting any better. I will have to, if, in order to make this work, we'd have to hit the peak of the bridge which is probably around this pillar, uh, and then and then go from there. I mean, you can see it quite distinctly now, um, as much as everything is getting in the way. I mean, look, we do, we go downhill just to come straight back up again. Um, but it's not as pronounced as it was before. Make it a bridge so we have options down the line. Uh, hold on, we are going solid here. Uh... All right, okay, come on, what's it going to be? Solid or bridge? Uh, it's two for bridge, three for solid so far. Uh, what are we feeling? Uh, Night Vicar, uh, thanks for popping by. Um, solid, bridge. Uh, bridge, solid, solid, solid. Oh, uh, and a bridge. And some more solids. Yes. Go bridge. Bridge. Better idea. I've got a better idea. That's okay. You're all good. No, no, you're all good. We're going to do both. We're going to do both. We're going to do bridge and we're going to do solid. Um, for I have a notion. Uh, and it's a good one. All right. Now then, we're going to go as far as about there. Are we? What, what, exactly, is your, uh, what exactly is your scheme here there, Skipper? Trust me. Uh, right, let's go that. Right, and then go. keep going until you turn into what we want. Right, like that. Yeah, and then we do it in a straight line. Um, is that is that what we want? 
that is kind of kind of what we want it's not too expensive so if this ends up being rubbish i'll redo it uh that seems to have snapped into a straight line okay we do that right uh and then we continue this uh on the flat in a straight line as a bridge right and then we'll turn it back into uh solid again afterwards huh see there we go best of both worlds surely a good uh a, a good compromise and indeed a good look uh right how much how many pillar let's get another pillar or two in there if we can there you go one more pillar that should do the trick now, obviously, I'm going to live to regret this. Goes without saying, right? Um, uh, yeah, I, I think it's I think it's inevitable that I'm I'm going to uh, I'm going to regret this particular decision. But uh, that's a, that's a regret for another time. Now, if I drag that as far as there, what's going to happen? It's going to work. That's what's going to happen. All right, grand. All right, we're going to go with this. This is going to look a little odd, I think. Um, but at the same time, it's going to look a little great. Right, now fling this all the way up there. And uh, and turn it into this bit. We want solid. Has it overridden the bridge section? No, it has not. Uh, this also works as some form of tidal barrier. Uh, which we could later turn into uh, a hydroelectric dam of some description, maybe. Um, there we go. Best of both worlds. Uh, <laughs> now some grey concrete piping and a fetid pond. Yes. Yes, absolutely. And uh, is it flat? No, it's No, it's not even slightly flat. But I think it is slightly... I'm going to say that it's slightly better than it was last time, uh, but now we have at least used a viaduct for no reason other than we all wanted to use the viaduct. Uh, and then we'll put some signals on here. You'll yell as soon as I get the signaling wrong because uh, that's why I like you people hanging around. Uh, you tell me when I've goofed. Uh, and then it's all good. Right, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Do all of that. Uh, let's get uh, let's get stuff rolling. Uh, that's about as many signals as we're going to get on there. Uh, right. Okay. That was uh, it. wasn't uh, It wasn't cheap. The end effect is not perfect. I think when I've got money to uh, to just throw around willy nilly, um, I am resisting pork barreling people. Um, when I've got the cash, what we'll uh, what we'll look at doing is. Uh, tasty uh is uh what we'll look at doing is we will look at expanding from the highest section of the bridge uh to to make this work i don't want to do it now because it's operational uh the san diego electric trolley is now available uh that's okay uh, i like trams just fine um uh, the, I should probably build some trams at some point. Maybe in a maybe in a future episode, we'll uh, we'll go for some tram action. Uh, not today, though. Right? How much are you packing in there? Sixty-one of ninety-eight fuel. Oh, okay. You're you're heading down to the next one. Okay, that's fine. Um, uh, right now, then one more passenger station. That's what we want to do here. Uh, uh, save. Thanks, Pix. Uh, right, yeah, give me that, give me this, give me that, yes. There we are, right, good. Uh, there we are, we have saved. Uh, many lives have been, uh, have benefited from this. Right, there we go, the, uh, the food train is now full. Uh, so on its return leg, I shall return it to the, uh, to the depot and we'll, we'll plumb in a couple of extra, a uh, couple of extra wagons. Uh, there's not a lot of food waiting, though. Four. Mm. Uh, but that's uh, that's to be expected as we're still bedding this line in. 163k, that's not bad. What's the running cost this year? Look at that. Negligible running costs. 
although that said it's it's like mid January so it will have been in motion already but we only lost 170k in the whole of last year so uh, so that's something and you are now carrying five uh, food this might actually be the uh, the first uh, food that's been delivered uh, what's the uh, viaduct mod called can't remember but I'll add it to the collection um, I think it's just called the Bridges and Viaducts mod, um, but I'll uh, I'll spin it out and add it to the collection. Now then, next trick is add another city, and I think it's going to be Indianapolis. Um, so we, what we want to think about here is we're going to run. Oh, actually, this is a ridiculously expensive city to add. Uh, no, no, I'm changing my mind. Uh, breaking news: Colonel changes mind. Um, we are going to go for Dortmund and uh, and Brussels because I need Brussels to kick into high gear quickly, given the the, the volume of trains that we're we're running through here. Uh, also, it's cheap, uh, so I'm going to run a line out to Dortmund, and then after that, we're going to fix all of the uh, all of the flashy red lights uh, that we've got going on in there at the moment. Uh, right, where is it? It's there. Look. So you're effectively, I mean, you're almost doubling back on yourself a little here. Well, it's, uh, it's not the first time. Right, okay, there we go. Spin that around there. Oh, it's an Utini look. Uh, Drunken Jim toasts the Colonel. Uh, all playing the drinking game has to down what's left. If you're playing the drinking game, kids, time to down it. Uh, always drink in moderation. Yeah. Uh, right. Okay. Right. Let's let's, uh, let's whack this through here. Let's make sure we're pointing in the right direction. Thanks for the donation, uh, Drunken Jim. Uh, very much appreciated. Uh, we do not want to tunnel through there. We really don't. It might make sense, but it's not. It's not elevated enough to to warrant a tunnel. I don't think. Uh, let's go as far as there. You know what? And once in a while, having something that actually goes above sea level is uh, is no bad thing. Um, yeah, we'll we'll persist with going over the top of this. Where are we going? Dortmund. Have you thought at all about where you're going to put the station in Dortmund? No, I have not. Well, perhaps you ought to stop mucking about with track and have a think about with that before you decide you need to change direction. Don't you think? Okay, let's have a think about where we're putting the station in Dortmund. Uh, right, there's uh, our north-south arrangement alignment. Uh, so, a connection from real seems possible, in, if not likely. Grand Junction, uh, likely. Wolverhampton, likely. And, uh, and then down to Wellington as well. And out to Barcelona. It needs at least four platforms, this one. And I think... The centre of town would seem to be the best place to do it. But uh, the AI has been busy um, and is going to make the centre of town challenge. So uh, which side do we want to go? I think we want to go this side. I think we're going to the left of it here. And that's why we're looking at this now. Uh, right. Activate bulldozer. Adios, Dortmund. Um, right, okay. Now, do we want to flex this station at all? Is there any benefit to be had in, in flexing it? Because uh, I've, so, I've got so used to not flexing stations um, that, uh, that it's not something that I, I think of automatically. I don't think so, actually. I, I think it just needs to run in parallel with that main street. Um, Let's have a... My goodness me. We've got... Oh, I, I installed the Flying Junction mod as well. Uh, but I'm not... Uh, we're not using that yet. Uh, if the situation comes up today where we decide to use it, then, uh, then we will. But uh, at present, not so much. Right, I'm going to use the Flexible Station mod uh, just to give me a few extra connections uh, rather than anything else. Uh, yeah, Mrs. M farewell, Mrs. Miggins. Seems like everywhere that uh, that old Migo goes, uh, she ends up getting it all demolished. Uh, right, okay, there we go. Now, I'm... see, that's that's a nice fit. You see, that fits in there rather well. 
is that how we want it? Or do we want to come out a little further here? Uh, can we shorten the uh, shorten the street length? There we go. Shorten the street length. Plumb that onto there. And then uh, and then that looks that looks viable. Station applied. Uh, right, okay, good. Now, uh, let's get rid of those, because that was at a strange angle. Let's get rid of these, because I need a road to go through there. And then let's put a road through there. Like that. Right, I'm also going to put a road back here. So it's a road to nowhere. Utini. Oh, hello. Uh, Salmon A. Yacht, long go again. Uh, what is the airspeed uh, velocity of an unladen swallow? It depends if you're talking about an African or a European swallow. Uh, right, there we go. I look at how old I am. Obviously, I know my Python. Um, now, uh, let's uh, let's connect this up somehow. The challenging thing about uh, about all stations that you try and uh, slot into the centre of town is is how the devil are you going to make it work with connecting one side to the other? Now, uh, I'm a fan, as you know, of uh, of building uh, gargantuan green steel bridges uh, over well anything really, um, but uh, uh, you know what? That would be a nice one. See, look, look at that. Look. That's this is this is my jam, right? Uh, oh, we could use one of the viaducty bridges. Uh, you know, to be honest, I'm I'm taking this. I was about to say, but no, for a change, I'm going to use a tunnel, but I'm not. I'm going to use that. Oh, look at that! Look, yeah. How can you not? I mean, okay, that's a little bit. That's a bit steep going up there. Um, but the overall effect, and it's going over the platform. Look, you know how can you how can you dispute that that is a thing of you know what we're even going to use that one as a thing of beauty. We're taking it uh, right. In answer to my to your, my question there of how do you connect one side of the town to the other, um, uh, there you go. That's uh, that's how you do that. Is you, you you stick a whacking great bridge over the top of everything. Ta-da! Hooray for us. Um, now then. Back to track laying. Uh, right, we'll leave the right-hand tracks empty for the moment, but I will build them out in case the AI gets any funny ideas. Uh, and then we'll... Uh, we'll roll out this way, which is possibly going to lead to a little bit of remod on the, uh, on the approach there. Uh, that said, I should possibly come round with a slightly sterner angle. Uh, let's get rid of this rubbish out of the way here. Or roads, as some people like to call them. Uh, there we go. Splendid. That's looking grand. Okay, now then. You, sir, come over here. And talk to this piece of track. It's probably the wrong piece of track, so don't connect to it yet. It is the wrong piece of track. Good times. 1.66 million. What the heck was I building there? That's a, that's an awful lot of money to build on what was a relatively straight piece of track. Well, uh, straightforward piece of track. Uh, right, let's, uh, let's have another look at that. This is the right-hand side. Oh, we are gouging out a massive amount of ground here. That's uh, that's not on. Right, let's go down as far as we need to. I don't like that much. There you go. Keep going until we are flush with ground level. There we go. All right, and this time it, this is obviously giving me. Uh, Giving me a little bit more, uh, a little bit more wonk than usual because uh, because we came over the mountain rather than going through it as we would do typically. Uh, right, sling that straight around there. What's it going to say? Three hundred k. A little bit of a little bit of lift throughout the proceedings there. All right, let's uh, let's drop those. 
completely flush with ground level, please. Right, let's go again. Now, I'm not opposed to groundworks, but uh, but if I can run at ground level, I, I would uh, prefer to do so. Uh, the price isn't a factor, because, you know, 200 grand for, a, for a, a reasonable strip of track like this is not so bad. Um, do we want to do we want to eyeball this all the way along? I think we probably do. There we go. Now then, is that that is as close to ground level as you're going to get? Because obviously the ground isn't a hundred percent flat. Um, although you know we could uh, we could give that a try. I've not tried this before uh, of uh, of running the smoothing gun. Over our uh, over our route to see if it does lead to a uh, a slightly more more flat experience. Uh, that said, you know flat track is pretty dull, uh, and you know what that actually that worked. So uh, hooray for us! Um, uh, massive success uh, all round. And connect it up. All right, good. Now, this is going to be another point-to-point -point passenger service, and we know uh, that that's not going to work. Use Shift and N and M. All right, okay, right. Show me what this rubbish does then. Show Shift and... Oh, hello, what's uh, what's going on here? So, the application of Shift has made absolutely no difference. It's just doing standard N and M. Right, that's just made a bridge, albeit not a bridge. Uh, there we go. So, uh, all right, let's do, let's do that. Nope, not doing nothing. No, I uh, I fail to uh, I fail to see the uh, the benefit to be had there. Now, maybe over a long route. Uh, let's try it here. Let's go like that. Right, we could do this, but no, it's it's still doing the same thing. It's just uh, it's inviting us to uh, to bridge stuff. So, uh, uh, so I don't know what you're on about. I use N and M all the time. Um, anyway, that's come out lovely, and I eyeballed it all the way, and it's come out lovely. So. Uh, right, okay, now then, I'm going to need a junction on here so that uh, whatever I, I end up hurling up this route will uh, will do stuff. Uh, there we go. Holding shift just prevents snapping. Well, that's it. Yeah, um, uh, that's, that, that is my understanding as well, Slim. Um, but I get told off for this on a, on a lot of occasions. Um, uh... So, you know, I, I like to not be told off for things. Uh, so I'm endeavouring to, uh, to, to remedy that. But at present, uh, I'm, I'm just being berated for, for my, own, uh, my own ignorance, I think. Uh, right, anyway, there we go. Let's, uh, let's continue our, uh, our jaunt up the, uh, up the jolly old way here. And uh, we'll do a bit of this. And then this is another route ready to go. Uh, ain't that something? There we go. And uh, this will be... This will be the ticket. Uh, now, this will be, be a European train we're going to run here, given that it's, you know, it's doing Europe. Um, uh, run that to there. And... Uh, I think it's going to be another PLM. I know, I know it wasn't popular with everybody when we last ran one, um, but uh, I'm not yet at the uh, at the stage of adding uh, many train uh, mods to the collection uh, because there actually isn't that big a selection um, uh, at this stage of the game. Maybe I'm wrong, actually. Uh, but anyway, this is going to be uh, Brussels. Mm, yes. To Dortmund. Welcome to the party, Dortmund. Um... Now then, how am I going to make this connect to anything that will get me a train? Uh, unless I unless I deputise one from another line. 
So obviously this isn't connected to anything at all. This is completely standalone at the moment. And I don't want to build another depot. Uh, so what's the other choice? I mean, I'm not ready to build a bridge all the way over, over there because that would be expensive. Um, but I do need, let's get this done. Here we go. All right. Yeah. Now is now is the time to be uh, to be getting this stuff in before the uh, before the AI completely goes bananas and and starts expanding everywhere without a care in the world. Uh, so let's uh, let's run this around here. Yeah, you see, this is this uh, this particular section of build is now starting to take on a life of its own a little. Uh, it's now telling me where it should be built rather than the other way around and. Uh, and that can only lead to madness. No, 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 no. no, look, here's what shift does, right? So you're doing this and you hold shift and it goes like, no, not going to connect to that at all. There you go. That's uh, that's the, the best use of shift I know of. Uh, do a bit of that and a bit of this. And some of that as well. Don't know where those are going. I just want them, uh, I just want them out of the way. Uh, so that I can continue a bit of development here. Now, has that that has separated one half of Brussels from the other, which is uh, an unexpected and unintended consequence. Uh, I may actually try. No, I'm, I'm obviously going to try and do a bridge first because uh, bridges rock uh, and tunnels don't. Ugly uh, much. All right. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's try what uh, what is so often suggested, which is do just the tiniest amount there, and then oh oh oh, not on. It's having to think. There we go. Uh, it, it, it had a think, and then it changed angle on me as well. Right, and then right, whack that up to be like you know. And then, and then you drive your van and you do a jump over the whole thing and land on that bit of rope. Uh, maybe. Ease it forward some. No, ease it back some. But we want to keep the, uh, the swiftness of the, uh, of the ascent. Stick a pillar in there. Go on. Go on, put a pillar in. Nope, we're going to have to keep getting closer. Uh... This is the alternate bridge building method, as has been recommended to me on several occasions. Uh, oh, it did it. I, I saw it, you saw it, we saw it. We're now playing the this is going to crash the game game. Uh, up. Whoa, that's a bit severe there, fella. Uh, down, down, down some more, down a bit more. Would you be inclined towards becoming a bridge, sir? There is virtually enough space underneath there. I don't think it is. Uh, you're going to have to keep going up. I think if that track wasn't there, let's have a look. No, that's track. You can't. You don't want to build track like this. You want to build road. No, 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 no. Up. Too much up. At what point are you going to start putting pillars under there? There we are. That, yep, yep, yep. Right, now. Down. Too much down. That's too much up. So we pull back until there. Maybe. No, this is... Ah, uh, oh, no, wait. Wait, 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 wait. I know what I haven't done that I should have done. Uh, is now you do the same thing from the other end. You've got to, you've got to put the catcher in place at the same time. Uh, so we do a bit of that. And again, aggressive upward swing here. What's going on here? Uh, prepare for weeping and gnashing of teeth. Yes. Hold shift over the track so it won't snap to them. Yes. Uh, all of these things are absolutely accurate. Uh, but what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to do a bit of that. Is that a similar height to this one? It's maybe just a little higher. Uh, and then we'll go from there to there. And Bridget. That's arguably a little more elegant than I would build normally. Uh, 
let's try something something new colors wise this this brown brick looks all right to me what do we think people he's lacking a shift key i he is not lacking a shift key i have two of them uh, i use them for playing pinball on my computer uh uh, what else have we got going on here? What's that one all about? Yeah, it's good, but it's not right. Uh, how about you? Obviously, that's the uh, the green steel uh, going on there with uh, with some proper aggressive pillaring, um, which obviously I like, but I use that one all the flipping time. Look, I mean, look there it is, and that fits even nicer. Uh, what do we say here? Uh, green iron. You have 10 shift keys. Woof. That's a lot of shift keys there, Slim. Uh, you want to take it easy. Uh, track construction for bridge asset mod. I don't I don't like the sound of that. Uh, Viaduct 10. That's that's good, but it's a bit bit too modern, really. I, I quite like the idea of building up some legacy stuff now uh, that uh, that stays in place for, for a little longer. Uh, we're all saying green steel. No, I use it all the time. I'm going to go one more of these, and then we will uh, we'll default to the ones that always look good. Uh, and it's just a question of... Yeah, see, I quite like that. I've not used this one yet either, so we're going to go with that one. There we are. Yeah, I know. I asked your opinion and then ignored it. Uh, you, you can yell at me later. Uh, right, okay, now then. Let's, uh, let's try and make that work again, shall we? I've got enough room to get some track under there. I'm certain of it. Uh, right. Do we want to snap it? No, we don't want to snap it. We want to, we want to come through like this, except closer. We want to come through like that. Yes, we do. In fact, we don't even have to come through like that. We can just uh, we'll do it this way. There you go. Take it relatively close to the pillar. Splendid. All right. And some of that. Okay, cool. Uh, oh, I, I hadn't actually built much track out there anyway, so this is this is largely a. Uh, oh, you've built something uncanny there, friend. That's uh, that's not what we were after. Uh, let's do a bit more like this, perhaps. That would be something a little more sensible. Yeah. Right. Okay. Good. Still good. That's all good. Right, now then, where am I going with this? Uh, we're trying to connect up to the depot. We're not doing anything too advanced here. We're, we're, we're just... Which means another bridge. Uh, although we do have a bridge here out to Brussels... Uh, out to... Uh, out to the rest of the world. Uh, but we need to get over onto this side here. Well, that... That plainly isn't going to work. Uh, well, you could dump this... Which has caused its it, it's caused its share of problems already, um, and then we could uh, I don't know do something uh, do something avant garde like that for nineteen grand, which will get the job done. So it's, that's not even a discussion, uh, right? Brussels Dortmund, we have a connecting line. We can get it running. I think. Uh, hold on, where does that go? Yeah, 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 we can totally do this. This is totally going to work. Right, Brussels Dortmund. Um, how exciting. Uh, I think we'll run one train on there as well. I'd, any more than that would be overkill at the moment. Uh, so uh, so let's get that a rocking and a rolling. Uh, while we're here, I want to... Yeah, let's put a stop to that. Just purely because I've spotted it. Uh, where are we? Give me, uh, give me one of these. Give me something... Uh, end of road like that one probably do it uh, let's give them some concrete as a ground texture uh, medium person's capacity and that will do nicely right there you go you live at the end of the road uh, for those of you who uh, who haven't uh, watched all the series so far uh, the reason i'm doing this is it will stop the ai building any further in that direction uh, I'm trying to keep Sioux Falls centralized around the station as much as possible and then growing out in this direction. It's not going to work, uh, but, you know, it, we can but try. Um, right, let's connect you up to there while we're here. 
And then let's do the same with this one while we're here as well. Right. Okay, what was I doing? I was doing something of use, I'm sure. Ah, I was buying a train. Uh, now then, let's uh, let's take you out the middle shed. What are we going to be using uh, this time? Right, steam locomotives. It's going to be the PLM. Uh, or we could go with a Prussian, but they are so slow. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the, 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 it's so slow as it only does 31 miles per hour. Uh, this one does 37. I mean, come on, man. Um, uh, yeah, okay, good. European train, yes. Uh, right into here. I want a cul-de-sac mod. I want a cul-de-sac mod. That would be good. Just a little, a little road junction at the end there. Uh, you clocked it, Mr. H. Yes, I was, uh, I was channeling, uh, the, uh, uh, the great Mr. Shatner there. Uh, right, okay, and then we'll go with, what do we go for? 55 will do the trick. It's a little bit short for a train, but it, there's, there's no justification for going any longer than that at the moment. Brussels to Dortmund. Um, I've been paused for ages here. There we go. It's another one of these. I'm going to turn this one a different colour. Um, uh, let's, uh, what do I, I don't know, let's go for a, uh, um, uh, an ua, uh, if you want orange. Uh, give me an utini, uh, if you want purple. I'll give you a minute. No, you, you, you're suggesting colours I haven't I haven't offered here. There's an Utini, an Utini, there you go. And there's an UR. I can't remember which was which, to be honest. Um, an UR for orange and an Utini for purple. Right, okay. No, no, your spelling is entirely your own choice. <laughs> so I have no idea who's winning. Um, uh, but Dortmund is yellow and black. I'll do the buses in yellow and black. How's that? Ah, uh, because we've got to do, we've got to do purple. I don't know. What do we got here? Uar Utini Utility. Uh, nice work. Uh, uga Uga. Yes. And Uar. Uh, 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 uar. And Uar. Um, I think the Uars have it, uh, but it's very, very close. Uh, orange and purple were the two choices. Um, Martini. Yes. Very nice. Uh, Utini with a late surge. The train is gone. Oh, hell! Um, come back! There we go. Uh, right. There we go. That's alright. There's no escape. Right. We're going to go with. Uh, it could be either, to be honest. We'll go with this bright orange. Uh, I, think, uh, I think the UR had the advantage early on. Let's have a look here. Why don't you look sharp? Do we want to see what it looks like in purple as well, just for the sake of uh, seeing what it looks like in purple? Firstly, find purple. I think that's the closest we've got, like a dark pink, and that's definitely purple. That too is pretty sharp, uh, but I think it's not as sharp as the orange. Yeah, that's pretty sharp, like a bulldozer. Uh, right, okay, good. Now you're progressing nicely. Uh, look at this station here. We, we plugged that in earlier and uh, it's, uh, it's got the people waiting to use it. Uh, and later on, we'll, uh, we'll find additional uses for it. Uh, meanwhile, coming out of here, what are you packing? 75 of 80 passengers. Profit. Uh, how about you? Uh... You are a disappointment to everyone, including your mother. Uh, yes. All right, what's the problem? Why does nobody want to go from Detroit to Brussels? That doesn't make any, any sense at all. They're quite happy to go from Vancouver to Brussels, but not Detroit. The Detroit's really quite the jump in town, you know. Uh, right, what have we got going on here? No one's waiting to go to Dortmund yet, but we need to put some, uh, we need to put some public transport in Dortmund. Uh... What's our coverage? Our coverage is actually pretty significant already. Um, but we could do... Could we? Well, we can do whatever you like, man. But uh, the, the question is, is it going to make you any money? Um, well, not in the first instance. Probably not. Uh, but later on, probably. 
Uh, let's put in a little bit of road here to get the uh, the AI thinking in a way that is uh, that is convenient for me. Uh, I'm going to try and I'm going to try again. I'm going to try and do this to there. That's nice. And then we're going to try and squeak it under the bridge. That's nice. And then connect onto there. That's nice. Hey, oh, look at that. That's that's pretty. That's pretty decent for a for a bit of uh, AI buildable, uh, right? And then on here we will bung a uh, sorry expertly place uh, a bus station depot stop. That's one of those for those of you who don't know already. Uh, I'd quite like to put another one of those over here. And you're thinking, no, the man's lost his mind. Why would you do that? Uh, well, I probably won't actually because it doesn't look like it's going to fit. I mean, look, I'm, I've missed by, you know, inches at most. I'll talk to the council and see if we can get the curb dropped. Look, look at that. Look how little I've missed by. Oh, God. Yeah, you, ah, there we go. We got it. Ha, 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 ha. You cannot defeat me. Uh, right, and then we'll, uh, we'll do a little bit more, uh, a little bit more building here. Uh, now, uh, just show me uh, show me catchment again before I start doing this. So we've got a little bit out there we don't catch, but this is the main bit. So what I'm thinking is that we'll do um, uh, from the stop here, we'll go out over there, we'll come back, we'll hop over the bridge, we'll stop here, we'll stop there. Everybody's happy. Uh, then probably do some kind of reversing sort of situation, sort of deal. Because uh, because uh, I do that, you know. All right, we'll stick that on there, and then we'll stick some up here. Uh, and this hopefully will uh, will come into its own a little later on. But obviously, we're going to pay for this early. Uh, right, close that, please, because you're just in the way. We'll go from there out to this one, uh, out to that one, out to this one, out to that one, and to this one. And to that one. No, you've done it in the wrong order. Remove these two. Yeah, yeah, right. Okay. To this one and to that one. There you go. No, that's rubbish. Okay. Uh, Lakeview Street. Remove Lakeview Street. And that. Start again. Right. So basically, we're going to go from here to here. Right. That's that's the route that we're going to take. Uh, but immediately after leaving exchange, we're going to go out to there. That's that's unhelpful, though. All right, okay. All right, there's a solution to that. And the solution is more bus stops that nobody uses. There we are. Right, okay. So from here, you then... This is, this is, the, this is the secret. You then go that way. And then you got a Lakeview Street. Uh, what's what's Sycamore Street doing all the way down there? No, 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 no. Start again. Right. Dortmund, Sycamore, this one. Thank you. Uh, and then over the bridge and into that one. Yes. And then out from there to College Street. And then back to Dortmund Sidings. All right, I've built some. I've built some weird-looking uh, 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 bus routes historically, and this is another one of them. And then back to the beginning. Okay, that that makes a little more sense than it did, but not a lot. Uh, but it will serve its purpose for now. Uh, Dortmund is going to be well. Uh, we could go for D T M D, which sounds kind of cool, or we can go Dort. No, let's do that, because that will confuse me later. Uh, this is uh, Station Shuttle. Uh, station Shuttle. Now, the reason I've got it hitting both sides of the station, despite the fact that they are really, you know, they're, that's not going to help anybody passenger-wise, is because uh, later on, when there are passengers who actually want to go places, that will make, uh, that'll make a difference. Um, 
Uh, oh, so I, I, I'm glad you're appreciating it, Sim Station. If, if I can make your night shift go a little bit smoother, I'm, I'm more than happy to do so. Uh, right, uh, there we go. Right now, then let's uh, let's plumb this in up here. Okay, there we go. Right, bit of that. Buy some road vehicles. Passage, please. Landowers, obviously. Uh, or do we want to go Le Blesson? No, we will go Landowers. Uh, and we'll go with three. One, two, three. And you can set line onto Dortmund. There you go. Off you go. And as luck would have it, the Dortmund train has arrived. Packed with no passengers, I'm sure. Are we packed with no passengers? We are packed with no passengers. The Tangerine Train rides again. There you go. House. Yeah. Another house. Yeah, but we're keeping pace. I'm going to keep doing this while it, uh, while cinematically it, uh, it makes some sense. That's a good look. I like it. Okay, good. Uh, when will trams show up? When are, when there are nicer trams? I don't like the early trams so much. If it was purple, it would have been packed. Yeah, so you say. Um, uh, right, okay, good. Let's have a quick review of the situation we have created for ourselves this evening. Uh, now then, our least profitable is the Sioux Falls Bulk Freight. Really? Huh. Yeah, we're just not. We're, it's just not shipping enough goods, um, which is a bit of a concern. Uh, oh, I meant to. Uh, I meant to Im increase the uh, the capacity on the on the food train, didn't I? Otherwise, everything's going to stop working, and that would be bad. Uh, where are you? You're out here. You're you're maxed out. What do we got waiting? Thirty seven. That's not a lot, is it, trucks? I mean, are you are you putting some effort in or what? Uh, right. Okay. Well, as soon as this guy's dropped off, we're going to get him to uh, to head into the depot. And we'll 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 fling a couple of extra trucks on there. Uh, how are you doing f uh, money wise? Two hundred grand in profit this year. Fist pump. Um, uh, okay, that's good. That's uh, yeah, that's jolly good. Uh, let's just increase the tempo ever so slightly. Get that rolling. And then uh, we've got 616 uh, fuel. Really? Oh, 616 waiting for the fuel line. Okay, I'm going to take you into the depot as well, mate. Um, we'll get you a couple more uh, a couple more wagons on there to keep this rolling out. And maybe that will help Sioux Falls as well because they will be adding extra stuff on there. Um, yeah, that could, that could work. Definitely two plus trains on that route. Either that, or just a much longer, uh, a much longer service. Uh, right here comes this one. Let's slow it down so that I don't miss the uh, the opportune moment here. Unload and depot. Right there we go. Right, what are you? Your uh, Alps, Alps bulk freight, that's fine. Okay, since you missed the purple train earlier on, we'll, we'll turn this... Oh, well, I'll, I'll turn it purple once it's, uh, once it's operational again. Um, but we need to, uh, we need to depoise the thing first. And then we're waiting for the, the, the fuel bulker to come in as well. Uh, so that we can add, I, I think we'll probably end up adding like another 10 wagons onto there or something like that. Um, in order to, to keep that demand rolling. How much are you packing? Two. I'm sure it's capacity that's causing this, you know, rather than uh, rather than anything else. But we'll see. Right, here we go. This is another good view, look. Oh, yeah. Right. Uh, let's uh, uh, buy trains. And then freight wagons. And then, uh, well, what do we think? We, you've got 
what's that? Six on there at the moment. Let's do uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's do another two on top of that as well. That takes it to 98 capacity. No, keep going. Two more. Uh, it's 112. That's more like it. Right, now then, what were you on? You, you really should memorise this stuff. Hub's food. There you go. Obviously, we're going to watch it coming back out of the depot. Right, there we go. Hub's food. Vehicles. Colour. Per play. Now, I think that makes those box wagons look a little too vivid. Uh, not in a bad way, it's just a little bit, a little bit vibrant. Uh, but it'll make the cows happy as they are going to the, uh, going to the end of the line. Uh, there. Uh, good night, Jesper. Thank you for stopping by. Nice to see you. Um, is it Motorsport Manager Day tomorrow? Yes, it is. Last race of the season. Um, and, uh, yeah, it's already in the bag. I already know the result. Um... It's quite a good race, I'm going to say that. Uh, oh, right. Oh, yeah, we're here. We look, we're, we're here at just the right time. Um, all right, I'm going to spend on this one. If you've got five minutes, it's going to be worth sticking around to watch this happen. Uh, come on, 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 come on. And... Please hold. And Depot. Right, there we go. All right, and now you see we're starting to get some proper sized goods trains going. 29 cattle on board. Cowabunga. Um, yeah, that's, uh, that's splendid. Right, I'm going to up the tempo just to get this done and dusted. Yeah, I know, we want to watch the... Don't worry, it's going to be much, much longer coming out the other side again. In you go. Thank you. Now then, ah, now, there is a potential problem that's about to happen here, and uh, and we'll get to that in just a moment. Uh, right, locomotives, steam, yes, obviously. We want to add another mogul. Right, uh, ideally at the front of the train. I, I... Right, scroll to the end of the train... Drop that one down as well. Then move it up and up. No, you've now got both of them at the bottom of the train. All right, we're going to do it this way. That's it. And then up. See, can't beat me. I'm too good for you. Uh... Right, now, here is where it might get problematic, because I'm going to add a bunch more uh, tankers onto there. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yes. Uh, that's, a, that's an almightily large train for this stage of, uh, stage of development. Uh, but anyway, right, this is Hub's Fuel. All right, brace yourselves. This, this will last a little while. Uh, yeah, I think, I think about here should do the trick. Right, and that is the end of the slosh fund. We've got 2.5 million still in there. Uh, this train is going to run re pretty full most of the time. Ah, it's a shame there isn't a coupling on there. That's, that's a pity. Uh, but, you know, I hope you like oil wagons. Because uh, that's what's happening for the next 10 minutes or so. Is nothing but oil wagons are uh, are cracking along. Um, <laughs> uh, thanks, uh, Kilmowski. Kilmowski, I guess. Uh, thanks for stopping by. Uh, much appreciated. Uh, right. Okay. Splendid. And it does look like a well-oiled machine. <laughs> hey, scrunces with the gags. Uh, I'll have a good gag, me. Uh, that's, uh, that's splendid. Uh, we want a two-kilometre fuel train. It's a bit early for that yet, but uh, but I can feel it coming, you know. Um, 
the amount of... I mean, and don't forget, I'm only delivering to two towns at the moment. Uh, you know, I haven't added Detroit into the mix. I haven't added... Uh, well, I've only got two towns on there at the moment. Later on, there will be more. Uh, right, let's have a look from above. And, uh, and I'll show you what I was slightly concerned about. Uh, what I was slightly concerned about was the fact that there is a real chance that this could now block junctions on the way into the station. But I think we'll be okay. So this is now rocking about 400 metres in length. I mean, that's not nothing. That's that's quite a quite a significant uh, amount of train going on there. Uh, it is pretty pretty magnificent though, uh, but it also means that uh, the days of developing this uh, this line are far from over. There is going to be a lot more line development that is needed to be done on this one. Um, I think that's a full load there as well. Three oh one. I mean three three hundred capacity. A year, that's big boy territory right there. Um, and uh, uh, I mean we've we've probably got enough grunt between these two moguls to uh, to get the job done with it um, but I'm going to want to put something uh, a lot more powerful on there the ideal would be because the, the crocodile is out before too long uh, that's the you know that's the first real uh, real talky monster um but uh, we're in the U.S. of A. here. We can't uh, we can't use the crocodile without without jolly good reason. We're going to just have to hold on for the big boy um, as this train keeps rolling. The good news, of, yeah, well, the good news is that uh, uh, we will get higher capacity tank cars before then. But uh, but this is all. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's a that's a train right there. That's a that's a beefcake of a train. Um, right, smashing. That's it. I'm done. That's that's your lot. Uh, I'm finished. Uh, how long am I going to be on for? N now. There you go. That's uh, that's the that's the lot. Um, uh, could probably get away with a Mikado. Yeah, quite possibly. Uh, a couple of Atlantics up front would probably work as well, but the Mikado most definitely will do the job. Um, Let's just have a quick look at the overall uh, runners and riders on the Profitron. Uh, Hub's fuel is about to uh, bust through even more. Uh, Brussels, Vancouver is printing cash. That's a seriously good route. Uh, Hub's oil is also doing very nicely. That should pick up even more now that the, uh, uh, that the, the fuel train is, is carrying so much. Um, Sioux Falls Commuter is... That's terrific. That's where we started off today. Uh, Hub's food has broken even. So that's now in the profit as well. Uh, who's the stinker? Brussels Dortmund. But it's literally only just started service. And then everything else is only double digit thousands. We're in the cash here, gang. Uh, I think we have a a accomplished the goal of, uh, of relieving ourselves... Um, of the uh, of the pork barrel fixation running costs let's say 10 million uh total in 14 million that's four million a year i can make that work we can do quite a lot with four million a year uh there we go that's it that's your lot uh let's find something something splendid to uh to to watch and it, it you know you're not going to get much more splendid than this flipping bridge this bridge is just great this is the best bridge I've ever built. Bold statements right there. Uh, right, okay, good. Will this be on YouTube? Yes, I'll chop it up. And uh, and this will form next week and a little bit of the week after uh, YouTubery. I've got quite a lot of stuff that I'm working on on YouTube at the moment. Um, so uh, so there will be some repeats of, of, of what you've seen this evening. Uh, but I'll probably add a little bit of extra commentary on there as well. Just for, you know, for the sake of variety. Uh, do the red signal thing. What's the red signal thing? Um, uh, and then... Uh, uh, that's your lot. Uh, thanks very much for watching. I've been Colonel Failure. Um, uh, to everybody who, who, who threw uh, a couple of sovereigns into my uh, tip jar this evening. God bless you. 
thank you very much. That was much appreciated. Uh, an awful lot of fun was had. I, of course, I've now got to go through a four-hour stream and find the one word I should not have said. Um, uh, that, that's going to keep me amused for a little while, I don't doubt. Uh, what have we got coming up? Put the, the red... The, I didn't do the red triangle. Let's have a quick look. Oh, everybody hates everything. There we go. Uh, I'll even leave that up there for you to, uh, to, to lord it over for a minute. Um, yes, thank you. Yes, I'm not saying that again. Uh, I'm scarred. We're all scarred. Um, uh, <laughs> uh, oh, here it comes. Look. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Where's the view? Uh, I think we had the view. No, too much view. That'll do. Um, uh, what was I going to say? Uh, what have we got coming up? Railway Empire. Uh, I'm carrying on with that. Rise of Industry. I'm carrying on with that. Uh, mountain Biking Game. You will see it on my channel again, but in a slightly different fashion. Um, but that was a one-off. Uh, spin Tires. Spin Tires. We're finishing off Spin Tires. And then, uh, what else? City Skylines is coming back. Um, what else? Panic Coaster. That's all good, too. Uh... Make sure you're subscribed over there on that there YouTube to make sure you don't miss any of it. Um, uh, I invite you to come along and join uh, Bad Company. Uh, there are links around here, there, and all over the place. We have a very good time in Bad Company, you know. Uh, it's a bunch of like-minded people having like-minded type fun. Uh, but there'll be more news on that soon because there'll be a new Bad Company trailer. There will. There's a, that's a thing that's, that's just going to happen. Anyway, I've been Colonel Failure. Thank you very, very much for watching. Um, uh, you're all flipping lovely. Uh, and, uh, and I'll catch up with you uh, in the very near future. And, uh, and now we push the magic button that I didn't test before going live. I'm, I'm certain, certain it's going to work. Cheerio!